What's up, Titan Nation? How's everyone doing? Woo! We got it. We got D Hop. I'm excited. I hope you're excited too. Again, sorry about it. I'm on vacation right now. Didn't expect to do any videos. Didn't think anything was going to be expected. Uh, breaking news wise, as you see, I'm in Miami. Got the pool in the background. I'm ready to go. I've been I'm drinking. I've been tanning. Look how tan I am. Sorry. So, again, I apologize for the video and how shaky it is because, again, I don't have uh, my stands with me. But let me tell you guys, I will always do a video. And I hope you guys are hyped. I'm hyped. We got D Hop. Two years, 26 million, and I think up to 32 million in incentives. So, there's going to be some bonuses for him. Uh, again, I'm excited for D Hop. Um, you guys should be too. I mean, there, there there's so much that he brings to the wide receiver core that's been very, very shaky. It's been very bad. This adds some depth into our wide receiver core. It helps with the um, it helps with the the young cats. You know, Traylon Burks. It gets a veteran leadership wide receiver. Um, it's going to be, I, I feel like it's going to be a lot better situation than the Julio Jones. A lot of people are, you know, comparing like, oh, what about, you know, what happened with, um, you know, Julio Jones? It's, I feel like it's the same thing as Julio Jones or, hey, this is the same thing as Randy Moss or, hey, it's the same thing as, um, <clears throat> what's the one from uh, Houston Texans? Oh, my God. Uh, uh, the one that fought Corey. Uh, Oh my God, I'm, I'm sorry. I remember I've been drinking. Uh, the, the, the wide receiver from um, the Texans that we picked up. Again, it, it's just put me put down in the comments. Um, it's completely different, guys. I think it's a different situation. D Hop's a lot younger. And um, it just, I feel like this might break the mold. Okay, this might break the Tennessee Titans trend for wide receivers and, and how they do it. Hopefully, they can handle them very well. I hopefully. They could feed him the ball, get him the ball more often. Um, I, I feel like with this new offense, uh, I, I feel like it's it's a it's a little bit different. Yes, we're gonna rely on the run like we always do, but there's gonna be a lot more uh, pass uh, passing involved. Hopefully, Tan Hill can get him the ball, and hopefully, he can you know actually make the throws he needs to. I think it opens up our wide receiver, um, our offense a lot, and it gives Titan fans. A little bit more hope. I feel a little bit more hopeful. I'm like, hey, I was nervous about the wide receiver core. Now, don't get me wrong. There's still some questions in the wide receiver. Don't get me wrong. I'm not op I'm not too optimistic where I'm like, oh, yeah, we're going to the Super Bowl. But it gives us that chance. It gives us we're competing, I think, you know, for the AFC South. You know, a lot of people are giving us, like, the cold shoulder. I don't think so. I think we're right in the mix, you know. As long as D-Hop can stay healthy and you know our team can stay healthy i think we have a chance to compete in the afc south i think we have a, a chance to compete in the playoffs but again we have to you know we have to fix those little errors those little hiccups that we have in the tennessee titans we can't do a seven game losing streak like last year because they ain't gonna cut it so my thoughts on it i'm excited i'm happy just shows you know carthon isn't just you know like they said oh we're, we're tanking or we're, we're, we're not, you know, we're not trying to compete. BS. We're trying to compete. We wouldn't try to put not all our chips in the D-Hop basket, but we're trying to do something. We're not just laying down and saying, hey, this wide receiver's core is good. Don't worry about it. We don't need no veteran wide receiver. BS. We need a veteran wide receiver. We went out and we picked one up. I wouldn't be mad about grabbing another one. Maybe not a no-name. Like, not, um, maybe not, you know, Anyone so flashy with like a big name like D Hop, but you know, just get another person out there that that's had a decent year and just kind of played under the and no one's heard about them. That's what I want. I need another veteran uh, wide receiver. I think it'll help us, especially with the injury bug that we've had uh, in the past years. <clears throat> so hopefully, um, hopefully you guys are excited. Let me know down. Do you guys like the agreement? Do you like the deal that he got? Are you excited for D Hop? Are you nervous? Which I understand if you're completely nervous or not. I mean, I get it. Within the past, hasn't been good. But I'm, you, you got at one point you just gotta you gotta give it a shot, right? And I'm happy that the Titans, even if this you know fails and it, he doesn't perform as we want him to perform, at least at least we went out and we tried to grab someone. We're you know being competitive. We're trying. We're we're bringing in talent. 
and hopefully it make, mixes up good. D Hop, woo, Derrick Henry, woo, Traylon Burks, woo. I am pumped, man. This is gonna be a good year. I mean, you should be excited. It, it's just right before you know camp and stuff, and you get that good feeling like, hey, the Tennessee Titans are trying to do something. We're trying to compete. We're going out there, and it's gonna be a good season. Hopefully, like I said, that's the best thing as a fan. As fans in general, is just excited for this year. I was a little shaky, like I said, with the wide receiver core we had going in. I'm like, oh, man, this season might be a little rough. Gives us a little bit of hope that D-Hop's in. And it just shows you, too, D-Hop uh, picked the, you know, the Titans over the Patriots, which is something in years past that's never happened before. Usually when a star player... It usually goes somewhere else, doesn't want to go to the Tennessee Titans. But it's been a you know a few years back to back that we brought in some stars. Just shows you what kind of organization or how much respect these players have now for the Tennessee Titans. We're not just you no know, just a wannabe team that you know we're just come here. He's gonna easily get over a thousand yards, and hopefully that's what we're pushing for. If he gives me eight hundred yards with a couple of touchdowns, I'm cool with that too. Okay, let's not go too crazy. Let's go tighten up. Mr. Titan, let's go. Peace out, y'all. I'm going to go drink and jump in the pool. Tighten up.